court. There's no way you're picking your ex-boyfriend over Jaden. There's no way. Dude, he's like the poorest kid in the school. He's not my boyfriend. He's poor. Poor. I take you into my home. Care for you like family? And you throw a party? I'm putting you back up for adoption. Make yourself at home, Courtney. Your bedroom's all set up upstairs, and the maids are finished for the week. And the pool's just been cleaned. Pool? The indoor pool is still dirty, but the outdoor pool, yeah, just been cleaned. I think I'm gonna like it here. Angel, the maids just cleaned that. Get over here and introduce yourself to your new sister. What do you say, sister? Don't mind my brother, Andrew. He's still in that childlike phase, you know, very mature. Oh, dad, I remember you saying that her room is cramped. She can just share my bed. I don't mind. Her room will be just fine. There's plenty of space in her room. The movies just didn't orientate it properly. If they had followed proper feng shui principles, then it would feel much more welcoming. I'm Joyce, by the way. And, uh, Courtney, this is Sonia. We're going on a date. I'm gonna go, or oh, we'll be still for up. Coming, my love. Wait, you're leaving? Unfortunately so. I know it's sudden, it being your first night here and all, but that's just how the timing worked out. Sonia doesn't wait. Bye, kids. Your father and his Porsche are mine for the night. I love you. Hey, I have an idea. Let's play a game of hide and seek. Yeah! Yeah! I'm supposed to sound like some good, clean fun. You guys go down to the basement. I'll come find you in a few minutes. Hey, wait a second. Hey, Alice. Spread the word. I'm throwing a house party. Oh no, we can't have a party. She's gonna wreck the house. There's four bedrooms, a plasma screen TV, and two pools. Well, the indoor pool hasn't been cleaned yet, so I guess one pool. Yeah, bring drinks. I never knew your parents had money like this, Courtney. Now you know. Is that girl by here? Slumber party. Guess who I invited? Who? Jaden. <laughs> And uh, you're looking really good. Thank you. I think um, maybe after the party's over and it dies down a little bit, we can get some private time. Yeah, I think so too. Yo, who 
invited kids to this party. Oh, we made it up. Great. Now, Brad, we just have to find your phone, then we can call Dad and put an end to this party. Oh, the party looks kind of fun. I'm gonna talk to some people. I don't want to talk to you, Taylor. Well, I want an explanation of what changed. Didn't we have fun? Don't those memories mean anything to you? There's no way you're picking your ex-boyfriend over Jaden. Yeah, there's no way. Ew, he's like the poorest kid in school. He's not my boyfriend! He's poor! Yeesh! Wait, no, no, that's, that's not what I... Taylor is poor, Taylor is poor. after someone who was so quick to forget I even exist. Who cares? That was awesome! Yeah, you can really play. I don't know why you guys are trying to flatter me. Come back in here! Who cares what those people think? Woo-hoo! He's 12. What? You don't have to be such a buzzkill. We're just having fun. Plus, he wants to drink, right? I'm serious. Leave my brother alone. And what are you going to do about it? Look at who came running back, Mr. Cowboy. What, crushing little kids to drink now? Fun, why don't you mind your own business? Family, trust you to watch my children for one day and you lock them in the basement and throw a party? How was the date? How was the date? We had to leave early because I got word that the police were in my home. I'm sorry. I, I, don't, I don't know what to say. My whole life I've been picked on for being poor. And I just wanted to be popular so bad, and I let that change me. I I put the kids in danger. Beer bottles. Liquor. All this in front of my children. This is beyond irresponsible. You are beyond grounded. I'm putting you back up for adoption. I don't think you can. I think you can do that. You're grounded for a really long time. 
Go up to your room and think about what you did. Uh, which one is my... Down the hall! Last door on the right! Dad? Dad, I know Courtney must have big time, but she called the police to keep us safe at the cost of her popularity. Doesn't that count for anything? You guys smell like beer and candy. Get to your room. All of you. I love you.